Now, what you're about to hear sounds like something from science fiction, but this, NASA assures us, is the real deal. A Death Star galaxy is sending out a powerful jet of particles and magnetic radiation that's likely obliterating any possible life in its path, notably in a nearby galaxy. NASA's Chandra X-ray Observatory has made the discovery. Known as 3C321, the system contains two galaxies in orbit around each other. Data shows both galaxies contain massive black holes at their centres, but the larger galaxy has a jet coming from its black hole. And the smaller galaxy apparently has swung into the path of this jet. Now jets produce high amounts of radiation, especially high energy X-rays and gamma rays, which can be lethal in large quantities. The combined effects of this radiation and particles travelling at almost the speed of light can severely damage the atmospheres of planets lying in the path of the jet. One is the actual electrons that are being sped out of the jet at close to the speed of light, and the other one is the radiation that these electrons produce. And we've actually calculated and shown that because jets are so light and fluffy, they won't actually have a huge amount of disturbance on the planetary atmospheres. Of a, of, a, of a planet in that galaxy. However, the photons that come out of there are really, really energetic. And the photons, because they're focused into such a narrow, narrow beam, can have a really dramatic and profound effect. And we're given some idea of that effect in this NASA animation of a black hole jet stream of photons. So basically, one galaxy is killing any possible life in the other nearby galaxy. It's not all death and destruction, though. The massive influx of energy and radiation from the jet could end up creating large numbers of stars and planets after its initial rampage is complete.